the tusk um, seal kit for the CR80 and CR85s. 1986 through 2002 CR80 and CR80R and CR85R and RB 2003 through 2007 and these seals there's one that I took out of the package Let's see if I can get this to focus very well the lighting and stuff and then here would be one that is an OEM seal. And they appear to be very similar, but if you look at the front of them, this says SFK, and this says, um, NOK right there. And they are the same size, and they actually look like they were made from the same machine, just like with this outer rim and stuff. They look almost identical. And then you flip it over, and they look identical on the inside. You, this one's a little wet on the inside. It has water in it. But this one has some marks in there where like a machine held it which isn't bad but it's not it's just like doesn't really matter they both have metal springs in there and see the reflection of that spring that would like hold this onto the crankshaft and this seal kit comes with the water pump seal um, it comes with both the crank seals it comes with the kickstart seal. It comes with basically all the seals that are needed. The number of seals that it comes with is one, two, three, seven, eight seals in the package. Um, I've never used tusk seals before, but they seem they look like they're pretty good quality. Here's the big crank seal, and again, they are different brands. This one's an SFK. All the tusks are SFK, but this one right here, from the OEM Honda one, this is a TNT. Let's see, man. They both feel about the same weight. Um, the marks, there's four marks on this one. Right there, four marks on this one. They're basically the same to me. I don't really notice any big differences. Except for, there's little things like, see those extra marks in there? Where this only has, like, Five, and this has a bunch more. This one right here has one. I don't know if you can see those very well. But inside there, there's little, like, pizza-shaped marks. This one actually has different marks in it. This little crank seal. And these are both crank seals right here. The packaging, it's just, like what you would expect from a not super expensive crank seal package. I've already cut the package material that's supposed to hold in the seals. So, and all of them except for one. But they all appear to have springs, except for this one. That looks like maybe the water pump one, right here. But all these appear to have springs in them. 
don't know about this one. Get over knife. Hmm, it's gonna be hard. Try not to mess up the packaging too much. Okay. This last one does have a spring in it. The factory ones have springs too. All the ones that I took out have springs. If you can see. This is no EM one. And this one is a factory one too. And they seem like they're really good quality, these tusk seals. Um, I've only popped out four of the OEM ones. The Tusk ones, um, it comes with eight, as I said. Here's a white piece of paper if you want to see them on it. If you want to count that there's eight or something. I'm going to see all eight of them. Here's what the backs look like. I know this video isn't that good a quality. It's the lighting that's not too good. There, that should be better. But you can see those little marks inside there. Where it almost looks like mold marks or something. When the... Or cast marks or whatever you would call it. It could be mold. Then there's those little lines if you look in there which I haven't really looked at looks like only that one has it there we go focused and this video is being shot on a Kyocera Brigadier this one has it too looks like the small seals have those little lines right there hmm this seal doesn't but you can see even some of the really small seals, well, all except for one seal, has springs in them. And I think the springs help them seal a lot. I'm not sure how much they really help. They might actually wear the seal out quicker if you think about it. Okay, so that's my review on the tusk seal kit tusk engine oil seal kit um for the cr80 cr85 there are a few years cr80s that won't fit it the really old ones but for the most part this should fit almost all cr80s mine's in 1991 that i'm gonna be putting this kit on and that's what these are out of in 1991 and these are actually in good shape it's just I've been rebuilding the bottom end, so I'm going to replace them. So that's it for this video. Subscribe and like, and check out my channel if you want to see other videos of the CR-80. Because I've been building it from just... Well, it was a running bike, and then the engine blew up. The piston skirt cracked, so I've been rebuilding the whole bike, the chassis, and everything. So, that's going to be all.